have a scenario, Denzel. I have a a F B. Oh, a first position HELOC with about thirteen thousand available. I have a personal line of credit with a zero balance, twenty five thousand. I have a few more debts to tackle before I start really attacking the mortgage. Great, great, great. Should I use the personal line of credit to pay off the other debts while just paying the HELOC minimum, or make smaller chunks and use the HELOC? Interesting. Find out what you're paying per month in interest on that first position HELOC because you it might cost you less. Because if you have a first position HELOC, technically that's a debt tool, but you only have 13,000 available space in there. So I'm assuming it's a big uh, HELOC balance because you basically, you removed the mortgage and put it into a first position HELOC, right? So that was a move. What? That was a debt consolidation move, right? You went from amortized to simple interest HELOC. Bomb, right? But you also have a personal line of credit for 25K. Because it's a smaller amount, using the personal line of credit might do you more justice to pay off those smaller debts first and pay the minimum payment, monthly payment on the HELOC. And then once you've knocked out all those smaller debts using the PLOC, then we can discount the BLOC, go back to the HELOC first position and just, you know, all income in, expenses out, all income in, expenses out. And then also use credit cards to your advantage to also shift more debt out of that that might be a pretty cool strategy, but it's always important to run the numbers and use Debt Snowball as your benchmark. Make sure you're always ahead, okay? Or you have an interest-only HELOC. Well, that sucks, right? So if I have an interest-only HELOC, yeah, it would be better uh, to, I guess, use the personal line of credit. You're already getting killed on that first position HELOC. Yeah, that's an interesting one. That's an interesting case there. But I think using the PLOC first, then eventually graduating into that first position HELOC. And this is why I don't really like first position HELOCs up front in the beginning. What I like to do is start with the PLOC, the credit card, eventually graduate into a second position HELOC at a lower interest rate and it's a lower credit limit, right? Uh, it's still, it's large, but not as large as a first position HELOC. Then you wipe out maybe 40, 50% of the mortgage itself. So that means you've gotten ahead of all of the interest and then turn the whole thing into a first position HELOC and you would be paying basically nothing in interest on that first position HELOC. So you're getting, you know, really beat up on a interest only HELOC and then the monthly payment is 600 a month, interest only. That uh, really sucks. So, you know, I don't know, I don't know. I, I think I like using the line of credit better than the first position HELOC because you have the ability to chunk. With only 13K available space compared to the how much is actually in debt on the HELOC, I probably wouldn't even wanna use the thing, right? Because I would need to get the balance down. Um, what's the difference between a first position and a second position HELOC? First position is just like a regular mortgage. It's just calculated simple interest. If you get the proper one, you've got, you've got first position HELOCs that are interest only payments. And then you have ones that are principal and interest payments. I like those a little bit better than the interest only ones. I want to know that I'm at least putting something towards principal. Then with the second position, it's a much smaller HELOC. So you'll still have your mortgage and now you'll have a second mortgage technically, but it's called the HELOC, home equity line in the second position. Maybe you get a 40, 50, 100K HELOC, whatever it is, in the second position. It's collateralized against the equity that you have in there, give you an interest rate, we do velocity banking. 
the interest rates are much lower and the payment on a second position up against a first position is going to be much less because technically the line is smaller. It's a lot smaller.